This is the Home Two Suites in uh, Victorville, California. And here's a room tour of room 324. Oh, that sounded weird. Anyway, Home Two Suites. Here's the address, there's the room. It is a, this is the smallest type room they have. It is a king suite. Doesn't sound small. Uh, don't let words deceive you. And don't let the pictures on the website deceive you. Um, I'm gonna talk a lot about this hotel. And um, I just came out of a stay from a courtyard in Marriott, which had bigger rooms. Keep that in mind, which was just five minutes down the street. Anyway, this is a king suite. When you first walk in, you have your little mini kitchen here. Light switches all the way over there, not over here. You have a half size fridge, three quarter size fridge, full size fridge in Europe. Um, the pizza bag did not come with the room. Actually it did, more about that later. Full size fridge, kind of, and a freezer. You get a supply of plates, a microwave, cups, other various things. You can see my strawberries drying, I guess. Uh, you have drawers with supplied silverware, some Pyrex, ceramics, cone, strainer, cutting board, toaster. Uh, inside here you have, you see my, my bags, uh, garbage can, and you have a garbage disposal in the sink, which is pretty nice. And it's a very deep sink. Uh, microwave, not a convection oven, unfortunately, which would have been nice. Um, Cups. As you can see, I put the coffee maker and the teas up there. They do give you this induction hot plate thing, which came in that pizza bag, induction bag. Um, comes free with the rooms. Um, kind of was dirty. Has some scratches used, obviously, but it comes with the room. Uh, as well as the cheapest, the cheapest dishwasher I've ever seen in my life. Full-size dishwasher, though. Doesn't come with detergent, I don't think. I don't think it comes with detergent. I guess I'm just gonna have to put that soap in. Um, lights here. Let's see, there's a night light. Anyway, here is the bathroom. It comes with a sliding door, which I'm assuming doesn't nope doesn't lock. Here's the bathroom. It is very small. Uh, it's not very small. It's a it's a decent size for one person. I just came from a courtyard Marriott, like I said, and uh, that bathroom was like three times the size of this one. Keep that in mind. Um, Nice and new. This hotel is about a year and a half old. You can see we have some towels down here. Hair dryer. And drawer here. Shower. Not too big, not too small. You get a nice shower head. Some Neutrogena soaps. I guess that's for if you were, um, if you couldn't stand. There's no seat, but there's a lower one over there. I uh, have the biggest shower. Uh, like I said, I saved a courtyard Marriott down the road last time, recently. That bathroom was three times the size of this one. And it had a normal door, which locked. So, yeah, keep in mind, this hotel is a year and a half old. The Courtyard Marriott is 25 years old. And the room is bigger, and the bathroom is bigger. I'm comparing it for the area. The view of the bathroom, of uh, the kitchen. Uh, here you have some shelves. You can stack with some snacks, like I did. Um, you have a lamp, somehow. There we go. A desk, as well as a office chair, desk chair, and then pull out desk. You can move anywhere you like, which I like. The courtyard had that too. I'll be comparing this room a lot to the courtyard since I just came from there. Um, here's what the king suite looks like. It's smaller on camera. It's it's smaller in person. That's kind of really what it looks like. Um, the the fish eye does, it helps. You get a nice full length mirror, uh, which I like. You have a sofa bed, should be, yep. Uh, pull out, ooh, it's pretty nice. A little unstable. I'm assuming it's some cheap stuff, cheap fake wood or something. I can't get it back in. There we go. Uh, at rest, couch. Decently comfy, it's, it's sunken in. Not the most comfortable, but pretty comfy. Uh, you have one 42 inch TV, I believe, uh, with some drawers, as well as a cabinet. You get a remote, two hand wipes. This was from the Marriott. They gave me the full pack. Hilton just gives out these small little things. Um, very tiny trash can, which will probably be emptied every day. That's the couch. 
Here's the bed. This is, like I said, king suite. You got over here, you got a nice lamp, lamp on each side, phone. You have an outlet, two outlets and two USBs, as well as a plug-in down there uh, and a phone. And an outlet up here, too. You also have another desk area over here and some storage down here if you want it. Two outlets, guest directory, some shelves. Lots of storage here. They, they, they did that well. The cabinets. Uh, luggage storage, where you can see my stuff is. Haven't unpacked yet. Uh, decent sized closet with a, oh, with a nice little hidden thing, which is pretty cool. Um, ironing board, iron, luggage rack, laundry bag, AC, which is controlled on the wall, thankfully, alarm clock, and a lamp. And the view here is nothing special. It is the highway. Now you're going to open the curtain. That's the highway. It's loud. If you stay here, get a room on the other side. If you're sensitive to noise type places like that. Here, I'll open it. There we go. Anyway, that is the King Suite. Um, it is the home too. I've never stayed at one of these before. It's nice, it's brand new. Um, I think in terms of hotels for brands, I think the home one would be a little bit better. And uh, I would take a, the, there's a courtyard Marriott just down the road here um, I just came from there a little while ago and uh, it was, it had more, the king suites there had more space. They're older, yes, um, bed was comfortable, they are bigger though. Um, with that being said, thank you for watching and if you have any questions, uh, feel free to ask in the comments, thank you.